Hi guys, great to talk to you. First up, can you tell me what legacy is all about? So, legacy is about um, these these kids in school who decide to throw the ultimate party in competition with the current reigning party. And it's about, you know, all the obstacles they kind of encounter and have to overcome to just throw this legendary party. The film was shot over just three weeks. What's it like working on that kind of time frame? Well, I don't have any experience other than that. Mm. So um, it, it, everything was quite fast paced. Um, but as I said, I have nothing to compare it to. Yeah. It was, do you know, it was, it was fun. It was, it was a challenge. It was definitely a challenge. It was difficult. I mean, because you have such a short time to get a lot of stuff done. So you have to be on point all the time. You you can't spend take after take after take redoing redoing it and rejigging it. You have to kind of know what you're doing, go into it and get it right. Because you have a certain amount of time to complete it and if you don't get it by the end of that time, you gotta move on or the film wouldn't be done. Mm -hmm. So in that respect, that was that was a challenge, but a good challenge. It was fun. It was fun. Now, Amy, would you describe this as an ideal first movie? Or do you think Franz led you down some like really dark roads? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I wouldn't say that. <laughs> uh, no, it was a brilliant first film. It was a brilliant experience. Um, as you know, I came from the open auditions and didn't have any professional acting experience beforehand. And to go onto a set and to be co-leading a film with someone like Franz, who had just come off Edge of Tomorrow with Tom Cruise, um, and has so much experience and gave me so much advice and the benefit of that experience is amazing um, and the rest of the the rest of the cast were very talented as well and everyone was very helpful and welcoming as well so yeah it was a really nice first film experience as well as being fast paced and let me just say <laughs> Amy is dope like she brought so much energy and so much life and to, 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 the, to the whole production and it was a pleasure. It was a oh, pleasure thank working you, Franz. with you. It was a pleasure working with you as well. Yeah, you knocked it out of the park. Yeah. A lot of your scenes were opposite a naked woman. Yes. That must have been odd. <laughs> um, it's unusual, yes, to be in a room full of um, predominantly men behind the camera and with the boom and all of that. Um, and to see someone that you know standing completely naked in front of you. Uh, we did rehearsals with a, a bathrobe on, and then uh, my character had to act shocked when she, when she saw um, Yasmin. Uh, and when, when the actual take came, the shock that you see is genuine shock, because even though I was prepared for it, even though I'd seen, read the script, I, I knew what was coming, it still doesn't prepare you for seeing someone's complete <laughs> Complete body in front of you, yeah. Mm. It's um, it's unusual, definitely. Okay, guys, I want you to work together on this one. Plan your perfect club night. I feel like there's gonna be some conflicting ideas here. So we both got champagne down. So we got champagne and down. But where we start, we agree I'm, on that. I'm saying we start with with pre drinks. Pre drinks is a, is a must. Okay. Pre drinks is a pre -drinks? must. Pre drinks get kind of buzzed. Not, not too, too much. Not, not, Got to get past the bounces. Yeah, we still have yeah. to get into the place. Yeah. yeah. Um, and then I'd say... Preferably no queue. Preferably some kind of VIP, VIP access, oh, yeah, well, something like that. Well, yeah, it's quite yeah. a bit. They'll recognise yeah. you from the movie. Yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, a nice... Start a nice bar. Yeah. I, like, I like to... St I like to... Cocktails. I like to, yeah, build up. I like to build the night up. So, pre-drinks. Cocktails. Yeah, cocktails at a bar. Yeah. Then onto the club. Yeah. And then after party. You always gotta have an after party.